podcast name is Chen and welcome to my den and you're watching Chen's Den. So today we're going to be doing a very cheap, very simple, really realistic clothing haul 2018 edition. Okay, so I've been watching a lot of clothing hauls lately and I just really enjoy just seeing all these other people on YouTube having just so much money to spend. It's just great for you, I mean. Like they're spending, I don't know, 58 freaking dollars on this tiny piece of fabric that I wouldn't even think will fit my cat. And honestly, you can DIY all this stuff. You guys are beauty gurus. You guys know how to DIY. Why don't you just make that stuff yourself and save yourself some money? But I guess you just have a lot of expendable income or at least your parents have. Because you know what? Some people, we don't have money to shop at Urban Outfitters, okay? And when they shop at Urban, they think that they smart Or Brandy Melville. I also don't have the body type to shop the one size Brandy Melville stuff, so. Moving on. But you want no tea, no shade, okay? I personally am just not really that into like fashion or clothing and I just want some simple t-shirts to just get me through the school year. But also, your girl is broke as heck and I'm trying to save her college, so let's get started. Okay, so what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you the most expensive kind of stuff that I purchased and then all the way down to the least expensive ones because that is how my motivation throughout the school year goes. Like, you know, from high motivation down to like, uh, low motivation. So I feel like that is an excellent kind of format and metaphor for today's video. Alright, okay, so my most expensive ones are these Nike ones. They're kind of dirty because I just went to cross country practice with them. I'm joining cross country this year because I hate myself and I want to just torture myself every Monday through Thursday. But yeah, those are very comfortable actually. The first time I tried them on and I went for a run, it was just like on a magical. Okay. You know those like moon shoes? 90s kid, even though I'm not. Um, but yeah, it was just like bouncing on like clouds. Not really. I was bouncing on concrete, but I'm um, still, it was like a lot better than the runny shoes I used to have. Okay, so the next thing I've got are these pairs of jeans. Um, I've had the same pairs of jeans ever since, I think, the seventh grade. So I feel like it's time that I get a new pair of jeans. These are from Hollister and they're the high-rise super skinny ones because, you know, high-rises, they hide your rolls. Ugh. Oh, gosh. Okay, so the next thing I got is just this cute cardigan. Um, it has like, where's the buttons? Where's the buttons? Oh my goodness. And it has like these, you know, cute little buttons. It's gray, as you can tell. If you're colorblind, I'm really sorry about that, but I'm just telling you, it's gray. It's um kind of thin fabric, but it's still very good quality, I feel like. And you know, sometimes I just really want to feel like a substitute teacher. You just, you know, why not? quite expensive side but I do feel like they'll last quite a long time and those are just stuff that I've been wanting for a while. Alright so moving on I got another sweater. Uh, this is also from Hollister. That sounds so basic. Okay. Okay. And in Florida like around the winter time it gets cold and by cold I mean like about 59 degrees but uh, yeah I just got this for the winter time. This is definitely not a summer wear. It was on clearance so you know I just had to snatch it. Alright you know what this means? This means equality. Good job, Hollister, for standing up for what's right. All right, so I bought from Hollister just because they had like that sale going on. It's like 25% off. And in addition to that, I also like joined as a new member, even though I already shopped there before. They give you $10 off a, I think a $50 purchase. So that also makes it cheaper. And I also am doing dual enrollment. So I have like that college email address that goes like .edu. So that also saved me some money. So yeah, definitely get as much discounts as you can. All right, so the next store I shopped at was Target and I just got a bunch of basic t-shirts here's the thing okay once you see me try these on you notice that like all these t-shirts look alike that's because they are alike I just got the same exact t-shirt in like different colors that's what's happening because here's the thing okay my school we have a really strict dress code okay we can't shoulder any shoulders so no spaghetti straps no sleeveless top so another thing is that we can't show any kind of cleavage because you know this ain't no Cleveland I live in the smack dab middle of Florida also we can't wear any shorts uh, that goes above our knees so that's why I just got jeans and not any kind of like short shorts also I don't have a butt for it the only cake I got is that pancake so Anyways, moving on to t-shirts, um, I feel like it would just be really boring if I were to show you just like the same exact t-shirt over and over again. So basically what I'm going to do is I want to try to associate a kind of personality or emotion or kind of feeling that I have with these t-shirts and um, I'm just going to describe to you them. 
Alright, so the first one is this grey t-shirt, super basic, super simple, like I said, don't get your expectations up. Now this is something I would wear if I'm feeling like, you know, a little bit in the grey mood, you know, a little bit mm, sad. You know, maybe I'll wear it during testing season a lot. I'll maybe wear it if it's like kind of cloudy out, um, and if it's winter because, you know, it's grey and I don't want to show any kind of pit stains. <laughs> There we have a, you know, cute kind of casual look for the sad season. The next thing I got is just like this striped shirt and I call this the wide world shirt. Um, this one I would wear if I'm feeling a little bit angry because you know what? Wide world paper is disgusting, but the shirt is kind of cute, so. The next thing I got is this blue one. It has like this little pocket pocket right here. Mm, I, 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 oh my goodness, Wait, where is it? Okay, it has this little pocket right here, and it's kind of distressed, um, not sure you can see, but yeah, it's a little distressed. This one I would wear if I wanted to go for like the 2007 look, where everyone was wearing like full outfits of denim, just like top to bottom, or I'm feeling kind of like hipsterish, and I really want to go for a distressed look because I can't really express my distressedness with the right jeans, because we can't wear any holes on our jeans, that's freaking great. But yeah, there's that. <laughs> This one is a shirt that I would wear if I have a class with my crush because you best believe that your girl is going to blush a lot and what better way to hide your blushness than to have a super red shirt to offset the amount of blush you're having. Does that make sense? I don't freaking know. The next shirt I have is also from Target, surprise! And this is a shirt that I would wear if I really wanted to, you know, connect with my culture because I am yellow, you know, because I'm Asian. This one is just like an army green kind of tee. Um, this one I would wear if, I don't know, I was feeling, you know, really military-ish. I love my adjectives. I can't wait to like get a seven on my IB English test this year. The last one I have is this plaid kind of scarf little thing because in Florida we get super cold. Not really, but um, it's just really great to have like that thing just around your nose and your mouth because when you walk in the courtyard and a breeze comes by, your nose is going to be hecking cold, okay? It's going to be red and it's going to be cold and it's going to be runny, okay? So you can't, you know, blow your nose into this. Actually, that's kind of gross. Just bring tissues. But yeah, that's all I have. Anyways, um, all of this, I think, came around to like... I don't know, $100. I guess it was really successful. I forgot to mention that Target also has like this, I think three shirts for $20, just like that kind of deal going on. So that was also really beneficial to my, you know, budgetness. I don't know, I like these shirts. They aren't like the cutest, but you know what? I'm not either, so I feel like that really goes with my brand. So I hope you really enjoyed this video. Give it a like, subscribe if you want, and um, Ew, I just picked my nose and yeah, that's really perfect cloud. Hold on. Look at that cloud. Wow, that is so cute. Anyways, uh, like and subscribe if you want and um, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.